What is going on YouTube? This is the Sending of Light. And as you know, I'm here again with another awesome, awesome video. And let's talk about some knowledge here. And let's talk about what's going on in our days and where we're living at. And as you know, the Descendant of Light thinks that we're living in the last days. And uh, basically, guys, what I want to talk about here is the Apostle Paul and from the Bible. And I want to talk about the stars. And I wanted to show you guys about the the autumnal vernal equinox here. Now, I think this is the key to understanding when he returns, guys. And let's look at this. Now, if we go to this here, it says that, it says, Happy autumnal vernal equinox, September 22nd, 2018. Now, for all my brothers and sisters out there who know their, who know their feast dates, we all know that the fall feast can't begin until the fall equinox. So how is it that Yom Teruel was on 9-11 if the fall equinox didn't happen until September 22nd? See, there's scriptures talking about how they had it wrong and how they're not watching and he would come unexpectedly. Well, I think this is why, because with every single fall feast passed, according to the Jews, there's another year to go. But I beg to differ, guys. I really beg to differ. Because I don't think that we've seen the fall feast yet. It says right here at 9.54 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time on Saturday, September 22nd, the equinox occurs and autumn officially begins in the Northern Hemisphere and spring in the Southern Hemisphere. Here's why. I'm not going to go into that, but the main, the main thing is, guys, is that the Feast of Trumpets, Yom Teruah, has not happened yet. Excuse the phone in the background, guys. But what I want to say is, is that we're looking at, according to, according to uh, tradition, guys, it doesn't begin until the first new moon after the fall equinox. And I'll, I'll prove to you by showing you, we'll go all the way from, first off, let's find the moon here. Let's find the moon here. Okay, so here's the moon, all right? Now, let's go to, let's go to September. September 10th, let's start at September 9th here, and let's go to about 2 o'clock p.m., because that's about the time we're looking at over in Jerusalem. I'm about 10 hours away. Uh, let's see here. All right, so September 9th, 2018, as you see, let's click on the moon here. We're at a we're at a, a completely black moon, basically. So we know September 9th ain't the. Remember, this is right here. September, I say, is according to the Israelites over there. This right here, September 9th, can't be their according feast. Uh, if we go to if we go to September 10th. The if we look at the moon here, guys, it still cannot be this here because the first sliver is not sighted yet. So if we go to, if we go to September 11th, this right here, according to them, was their feast. As you can see, 
we have the first sliver visible. So, now, now that we know that, we know that this is false. And this cannot be the Feast of Trumpets on God's calendar. Because we're not past the fall equinox on September 11th. So let's take our let's 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 go all the way to September twenty second here. Now, this is the fall equinox, guys. And as you see, we have a completely full moon here. Completely full. So, if we go to, I'm going to take you guys all the way to the next new moon, okay? And we're gonna, I'm going to prove to you guys that this is not, as I say, this is not the true Yom Teruah, okay? And it's just, this is just more evidence providing that here. September 23rd. September 24th, September 25th, September 26th, and then let's also check the 27th, the 28th, as you see it's going dark guys, the 29th. The 30th. Okay. It's making its way. Now. October 1st. As you can see. It's still half full. October 2nd. October 3rd. October 4th. And so on. Now, October 7th, the moon is dark completely. But according to the Jews, this is still not their new moon. Their new moon is when the first sliver is sighted. Okay? First sliver of the moon, the first new moon after the vernal, the fall vernal equinox. So as you see, we're still on October 7th and we have not seen the full moon with the first sliver yet. So October 8th, as you can see, it's still dark. October 9th, still dark. October 10th, it is still dark, guys. Now, October 11th, 2018, the first sliver appears. Not only just that, but it's in the scales of Libra, which means judgment. Who else is in the scales with the moon? Jupiter, guys, the king planet. Is this God's appointed time on the calendar? As I always say, only you can decide. But all I can say, guys, is, you know, stay ready and get prepared. For we know not the hour that the Son of Man will come. And... As you can see, a lot of people say when the when she's when Virgo is clothed with the sun and the moon's under her feet, it's the same sign from September twenty third, twenty eighteen, without the crown of twelve stars. But every year, Virgo's clothed with the sun when the Feast of Trumpets takes place, and the moon even being under her feet. Okay, guys. And even more stranger than that, even more stranger, you know what's strange, guys, is that they tr they they tried to say the meteor shower of the Draconids occurred already from the seventh and the eighth of October. I beg to differ. I beg to differ. Something's up here, guys. 
because in the past times the the meteor shower didn't occur till about the 10th and the 11th of October and I'll do another video to show you guys that but I'm saying keep your eyes open because something is going on here and they're really doing their best to cover it up they're really doing their hardest as you can see but guys this is the sending of light don't forget to like share and subscribe if you like this video and I, again I want to thank you all for watching and I, I also want to thank you for all my subscribers that do that have subscribed to my channel every single one of you are much appreciated keep your eyes on the skies guys this is the sending of light I love you all brothers and sisters God bless you see you next video I'm out